guys, so the religion of peace is violent again. Totally shocking, right? Yesterday in Paris, masked gunmen went in with AK-47s, shot and killed 12 people, injured 11, four of which are in critical condition. This happened at the satirical office of Charlie Hebdo. It was a magazine that frequently published images that were offensive to different religions, not only Islam, also Christianity and Judaism, and they were targeted specifically because of their depictions of Muhammad. And of course we know that this is a faith-based fueled attack because the gunmen were shouting things like, we are avenging our prophet, and Allahu Akbar, which means God is great. Thousands of people have shown their support by gathering together with signs reading, Je suis Charlie or I am Charlie. And both of those hashtags are currently trending on Twitter, so if you want to use them, that'd be great to help promote the message. And a lot of people probably think that that might be silly or that talking about it on Twitter or different forms of social media is not helpful, but it really is because we need to get the word out. I think we really need to come together on this. I mean, every post you see, share it. Make your own posts, make your own videos, wear offensive t-shirts, hold offensive signs, show them that you're not afraid. And while we're speaking of fear, do not be afraid to call this what it is, an act of Islamic terrorism. I'm so sick of people avoiding that. They're trying to be so politically correct and it's not helping us get anywhere by ignoring the problem you're not going to get rid of it. I've seen different articles from The Blaze and Salon and they totally ignore the details of this attack in order to focus on what's really important, right? The fact that Richard Dawkins blames Islam for the actions of Islamic extremists. That's right, people are more upset that an atheist spoke out against religion than they are with the religion that fueled these attacks. You know, the one with the peaceful holy book that says to terrorize the infidels. Now I know a lot of people are going to knee-jerk react to this and say, not all Muslims are terrorists. I know that. I'm not trying to say that. I would never say something like that. But I don't see a lot of moderates out there standing up and saying something about this. Honestly, most people that I see that claim to be moderates have this, ooh, don't piss them off mentality. I mean, if you're truly a peaceful person, then you should be very outspoken about this. It's not good enough for you just to simply be nonviolent yourself. You should stand up strongly against any violence in the name of your religion or God. Now, I've been spending a lot of time on Twitter looking at this just to see the opinions of different people who claim to be moderates, and most of them take the approach that, well, she asked for it. Let me tell you something, a short skirt has never made rape okay. And if someone themselves aren't rapists, but they still hold that mentality, are they considered peaceful? Because I don't think so. Saying that the controversial nature of these cartoonists made them somehow deserve murder is completely ridiculous. Very sad with Charlie Hebdo incident. We shouldn't mock, insult other religions, races when voicing opinion. After looking at cartoons by Charlie Hebdo, I begin to rethink. Maybe they should have not insult Prophet Muhammad so much. Listen, I am a Muslim, but I am not violent as many would presume a Muslim would. But those cartoons, are they necessary? Well, I mean, if she didn't want to get knocked around, maybe she shouldn't have nagged so much. And one really strange thing about this mentality, one that so many people cling on to, is that it assumes that Muslims are killers, that murder is their default state. Kind of like how she's asking for it assumes that a man's natural role is a rapist. Is that really what they mean to say? At my core, I'm a killer. All you need to do is provoke me enough. And to be clear, the kind of provoke that I'm talking about is not something that they would need self-defense for. It's nothing that would ever threaten their safety in any way. Something like, for example, a cartoon depicting Muhammad. What's stopping me from killing people is not that I just simply haven't been provoked enough yet today. It's because I'm not a fucking killer. I'm a Muslim and I'm against terror, so it's not about Islam. It is most definitely about Islam. I already said that they screamed, God is great, and said we're avenging our prophet. This was not like it was an attack on a political group. It wasn't an attack on a state building or any government officials. It was a satirical magazine that was attacked because of their depictions of Muhammad. It most definitely is about Islam. Now, of course, there are Muslims out there who themselves are peaceful. But that does not mean that Islam is a peaceful religion and it is about damn time that we acknowledge that fact. Sorry if that offends you, Ben Affleck. So like I said, I feel like it's really important that a lot of people are talking about this. Use those hashtags on Twitter. Share this video, make your own video, post about this, talk about this, like this video. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments section below. And of course, I'll leave all relevant links to articles that I've been reading and found interesting in the description below along with all of my information. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.